Thomas here. So today, going to be learning the 360. Last video, I taught you guys how to land a back roll, but if you're new to this channel, go check out that video too. Land that trick easy. So, the 360. First thing you wanna do before doing this, if you have a trampoline, I suggest doing this. So, I'll take your rope, go tie it to a tree, tie it to your mom's car, do whatever you want. So, you have your rope. If you don't have a trampoline, just tie it to the freaking tree. And, yeah. No, so I just practice it without being on the water first, just to like know what you're doing. So trampoline helps though, just to get a feel of like jumping, kind of like popping it off on the weight. So I do that for most of my wakeboard tricks. So 360, you're on your trampoline. Ooh, easy, done, see ya. No, so guys, what you wanna do is, I'm left foot forward, so I'm gonna be riding like this. And once you get to the wake and you pop it, you wanna pull in, pull it to your other hand, behind the back, and then spin like that. So you don't wanna spin like this, trying to do like this stuff, because that's not gonna help you much. You wanna jump the wake, pull it in, go around, and then you can either land with one hand, land with two, whatever you feel more comfortable with. I landed with like one, like when I first learned a 360, I kind of landed like this, and then once you get more comfortable, you start landing differently, but I would land probably one-handed like this to keep your balance, and then with your knees bent, and send it. Yeah, that's it. No, so doing a 360, I learned it half wake. You can go for it, wake to wake, but I'm gonna talk about doing a half wake first. So. You don't want to edge out all the way like you normally do to do a wake to wake jump. So maybe go like halfway, you know. So go out, wait a few seconds on the rope catch. One, two, three, go in, heels, get to the wake. So your progressive edge, I talked about this in my back roll video, learning your first flip. So you want to go out, one, two, three, cutting in slow and then popping off the wake. You get to the wake. Pull in, then turn, and then boom, land left foot forward. Easy as that. So, you literally just gotta get the balls, go for it, send it, dude. So, you wanna land that like half wake, maybe five, six times, and then you'll, you'll get a wake to wake like that. But before you go wake to wake, I would do just a regular wake jump, don't do anything just to get the feel, see where you're gonna land for the trick. So after you've done that, go back out, look at the way, be like, that's easy, bro. Go in, so you're going edging out further for the wake to wake. So you're gonna go out, one, two, three, progressing your edge, like cutting in a little bit more each time, if you guys know what progressive edge is. So you get to the wake here, I'm gonna show them the video, of me doing it right here, half wake, and I'll show you guys wake to wake. So I'm starting out, waiting, letting the rope catch up. I'm edging in slowly, getting to the wake, pulling it around my body, and then landing with one hand, or you can land with two, whatever you guys feel more comfortable with. But that's pretty much it, guys. And then for the wake to wake, I'm going to edge out further, and you go out and then wait three seconds again, like normal, let the rope catch in. But you're gonna be edging in maybe a little bit harder, but you're still not like edging really hard at the wake. So going in, progressive edge, get to the wake, pulling it around my body with two hands, and then landing with one. With my legs bent, leaning back. So one thing I did when trying to learn this trick was I leaned forward too much. So I get to the wake and I'm like, ooh, and then they just throw me off and I wouldn't get the rope. So leaning back helps a lot. And this trick, I had to like think about it every time. I'd be like, okay, I'm leaning back, I'm leaning back. And after I did that, I landed like six in a row. And then I went wake to wake and landed it. So it's pretty simple, guys. You'll get it. Then you'll be landing like 540, 
like that instantly. No, maybe not. We'll see. So just remember, edging in, you want to pull in once you start to spin. So you want to kind of look over your shoulder like this, pull in here. And you can land with one hand, bend your knees right away. Easy as that. So guys, also, if you need some gear, check out weightcomerstock.com right here. Link will be in the description. That's my website, guys. I'm a um, approved Conley dealer. So um, you can call me or text me if you have any questions. I'll probably hook you up with a discount or whatever. If you saw this video, put a like, comment, and subscribe for more. See you guys. I'm out. What?